History of Mermaids In the last few thousand years, practically all sea of Earth civilizations have included mermaids, or sirens, fabled water creatures, or spirits, into their folklore and popular culture. These legendary beings, who were frequently portrayed as gorgeous ladies with a lower body that resembled a fish tail, were able to conjure up both the atmosphere of love mythology and terrifying tales. Mermaids and sirens originally symbolized the unknown of the sea, perils of open water, and uncharted water regions. However, as our culture and science advanced to a modern state, mermaids and sirens had a solid grip on our imagination and started to appear in art and other forms of media. The sea refused to hide her beauty or change the upper half of her body when she submerged herself to turn into a fish. Different cultures adopted many of the traits of the mermaid legend as it spread around the world, occasionally creating creatures with completely different attitudes on mankind. For instance, the Greeks dreaded mermaids and referred to them as sirens, dangerous beings that lulled sailors into the water with their singing before drowning them. Persian viewed mermaids not as half-fish, but also as complete human beings that were able to live in the sea. In the many stories that were written about them, even in the famous collection of folk tales 1001 Nights, there are depicted as beautiful men and women who can have children with ordinary people, and their children can also live in the sea if they want so. Dozens of highly publicized sightings from all four corners in the world kept the myth of the sirens fresh in the public minds, and even fake or manipulated findings of dead merfolk bodies did not manage to shatter their popularity. The adventure of the mermaid princess to reach the land is depicted in this work of fiction, which established mermaids as well-liked mythological beings and served as the inspiration for all subsequent media productions, 